On today's episode of Simply, we are tackling my coffee and tea cabinet. This thing is jam-packed and I can't really find what I'm looking for. So we're gonna be removing it all, decluttering and finding the perfect organization pieces to make this space functional and beautiful. Let's get started. First things first, we just have to get some things out of here and see what I have. I have way too many mugs up here. We don't even use these. We probably use the same like six mugs. A little bit of a mug quarter. We have coffee and tea, crystal light packets or just like drink packets, all the different sweeteners, flavorings. I'm starting to see what we use and what we don't use. That'll give us an idea of what types of products we'll need to organize. Now that we're done, it's time to get these products out and begin creating our functional yet beautiful coffee and tea station. I found these stainless steel coated hooks for underneath the cabinet. They come in a wide variety of colors. I think chrome, black, and brass. These are pretty easy to install, but one thing to keep in mind before installing is to make sure you're using the widest mugs that you have to do this because if I you know, move this over here too far and I try to put this you know, on this side, it's gonna be kind of tight and then also it might not close the door properly. So you need to figure out, okay, how far back is this going and how far over can we go? But once you figure out and measure that out, then the install is pretty quick and seamless. And we are on our way to a clutter-free coffee and tea cabinet. If you have a lot of bulk coffees, maybe you grind your own whole beans, you need to have some airtight canisters, but these are so beautiful. And because they're gonna go up on a top shelf, I like that they're in this bamboo holder so I can just take the whole thing down. It even has its own little scoop. I love these containers because the vacuum seal helps protect against both air and moisture, creating fresher beans that last longer. All right, now let's get into the teas. I was keeping my tea bags in their original store boxes, but I found this bamboo tea organizer with a clear top, which allows me to see all of the teas I have, but it's great because if I need to save more space, I can stack things on top of this. My matcha tea. Again, you can find bamboo organizers to fit your needs, but I just keep all the items for making matcha in one area, so that way I can just take it down out of the shelf. Now, I love a good flavored coffee syrup, so we are going to decant some of my favorite flavors into these to really give the whole coffee bar feel. We also needed something for our mix-ins like honey, stevia, and sugars. And this next product, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it does have a slight incline and arch so that products can sit a little higher. We're going to keep it at the top because it's not something that we use daily. We have a couple different sweeteners that we like to use. I'm a stevia gal, Kyle likes sweet and low. So we're gonna fill this up and keep rearranging. I'm a huge fan of adhesive wall mounted products. And this is actually a remote control organizer, but we're gonna be using this for our drink packets. And we're going to get it out of the actual cabinet and onto the inside of this cabinet to save as much space as possible. A few little extra touches I wanted to share with you guys. In the morning, we tend to go through a lot of spoons. So I figured if we delegated some coffee spoons in the cabinet, we'd be good on the spoon situation. It's just, it adds a little flair. It looks cute. To go with the little tray situation, I found some cute salt and pepper shakers, very simple. And I filled them with some of my favorite coffee foam toppings, cinnamon and coconut sugar. I love these coffee clips for my coffee bags. They're super cute, very durable, and it's the small things that can really make a difference in finalizing your station. just looks so much more functional and it looks amazing. So what do you guys think of my new coffee and tea cabinet? I know I love it and it's going to make our morning coffee that much more enjoyable. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Simply. Don't forget to subscribe to the Real Simple YouTube channel so you never miss a video. You guys can also check us out on realsimple.com and we post all the videos on our Instagram on the IGTV.